could yeah, use. Yeah, 100%, because he's got a little bit more experience, right? Yeah. Um, now, when, when you talk about, I mean, when you mentioned Tommy, you mentioned Tubbo, you mentioned yourself, you're all very young, mm -hmm. right? And with, with this business, it's no secret um, that with this business, you are in the fortunate position to have earned uh, now a, a good living for a good living for anybody, probably, and a good living for especially somebody your age. You've been uh, it's a great opportunity. Mm -hmm. how, how is that? How have you taken that part of, of the business? How has that part been for you? Well, it's definitely, um, I'm really actually happy about like the way that I've been able to handle it is that like, I'm still like, like very anxious about it. So I just like, I'm just like, okay, all this could go away in like a, a like a month or like a week. So then I, I'm, right. I'm still like very like, I still wear, I still wear like the same pair of shoes that I've been wearing for like, for, like three years. Like I don't, yeah. like I don't really, I'm, I'm kind of like more like nervous about it, but I think that also helps me in not like, you know, being like dumb with it sometimes, which is good. Rambu, that is actually so incredible. And you should be very proud of yourself for that because so many people your age and my age, for example, uh, 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 as well, would take the money and blow it on le like expensive cars, <laughs> expensive clothes, expensive watches. But you are being mm. very wise and you're saving your money because you're right, it isn't guaranteed. You don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. So you're very wise to do that. It's very smart. Yeah. Yeah. It's definitely it's definitely been really, really cool to also um just like be able to like help using it as well. Like cause yeah. that that stuff's been, been absolutely awesome. Yeah, so you 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 speaking of helping and, and using money for a good cause, you have uh you have a big passion for charity, as more specifically the Trevor Project. Um Talk to me a little bit about how you got uh, aligned with the Trevor Project and, and why that became one of your uh, preferred charities and things to, to contribute to. Um, yeah, well, basically, um, the, the Trevor Project was basically, um, the way that I find uh, charities is I search through other YouTubers kind of charity streams. Yeah. Um, and then I found I found this one and it kind of it kind of hit a lot like harder for me, right? Because I like lost uh, one of my family members like of them taking their own life because of like what they were struggling with. So then I decided like this would be like a really important one to do. Um, and when I decided that I wanted to do a subathon, I kind of felt like odd about it, like being like, oh, this is a subathon, but then it's going to be like for like for just like me and everything. Um, so then I turned it into a charity subathon. And then I was able to um, I was able to like I think we raised like over a hundred thousand dollars for it, which is really really. That's awesome. You know, I'd say that it, um, it is such. I, I've been through the struggle myself. I'm now out. I'm very. I'm out, and I'm proud, and I can now speak about it. But I can tell you, it's so. Mm -hmm. It's such a great thing you're doing because I know you do have a very young fan base, and there are many people within your fan base that are perhaps having the same struggle that I had. Uh, it, 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 you know, or I, I, I can only speak about my personal struggle or whatnot. Um, I don't want to speak for anybody else, but you know, I can tell you that uh, it, it, it's a very good thing that you're doing because, and I and I'd say to anybody in the audience, you know, that may be dealing with that struggle, it is you are normal. Okay, there is nothing more normal than operating with it or being on the spectrum of sexuality somewhere. Um, it is normal. It is what it is to be human. Um, and anything, anybody that tries to tell you otherwise, they uh what they're preaching that that is wrong scientifically um Stupid. and uh morally in my opinion so you are normal no matter where you where you land on the spectrum of sexuality or or gender you are normal and uh i think that that's one of the struggles if i could say for myself um it was really the, the feelings like I felt like it wasn't normal. Well, no, it is normal because that's what it's like to be human. Anyway, I could go off on a tangent, but I think it's really good um, uh, what you're doing. And I, I think you said on the, I think I hear on the, on the charity stream, you raised over $325,000. Yeah, that was for, um, that was for charity water actually. Yeah. It was again, a really cool charity that I found. I found that one through um, actually Corey Kenshin as he did a wow. charity stream a while back. Um, with it. And I was just like, this is like really, really cool. So then we were able to like, I, I was just like, hey, I'm going to do another charity subathon. And uh, going into it, I actually didn't expect for it to be as big as it like actually did. 
because I thought, yeah. okay, you know, like the, when I did the first charity stream, I kind of hyped it up a little bit more, you know, so it's probably going to like, like perform like a little bit less, but then it actually performed like almost like one and a half times as much, which was like absolutely incredible. That's so, um, yeah, amazing. No, we, it was cool.